Okay, so I'm gonna make a video today on John Deere 110 garden tractor. I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna teach you guys how to change the height on the mower with these wheels. It's actually pretty simple. I mean, I did it earlier, but I'll. I think it's set it at three inches. I'm not sure. I'll have to check. Um, gotta get the grass off here. Sorry. Um, I actually have the book here, owner's manual. I got with it. Um, here, we'll do it this way. Let's see. Let's focus so you guys can see it. This is really how it is. Operations, general maintenance, storage, and all that. Um, I don't really know what to go, so we'll flip through here real quick. Let's see. Stopping adjusting control knobs. Um... Let's put it actually on the hood so we can open it up. I mean, here's something. This isn't what I did. This is also something you can do, adjusting depth control, power adjustment, and now is the mower or center blade to return to the same preset height as the same as it is lowered. So really this, and it's right here. It's showing it right, oh, wait, wrong one. Right here. That <coughs> is actually right here on the tractor. It's that one. But I'm not worried about that. We're going to do the wheels if I can find it. You know, crappy reader, so I never know what I'm doing here. I'm not one of them tech whizzes with this stuff. So, oop, yeah, this book's not in very good condition, I guess. I'm pretty sure it was this one. It's this book. I have another one, so don't fail me now. Um, and this is giving you, like, reset all the spark plugs and stuff. Yeah, I gotta get this done because it's getting cold in here. Um, yeah, I'm not really seeing anything. That's crappy. Storage troubleshooting. Huh. Okay. So, we have another book. That was the main, this is the owner's manual, rotary mowers. Oh, this is the one I wanted. Oops. I guess if I paid attention. But, you know, knowing me, I never do pay attention. Okay. So, here you go. Oh, oops, excuse me, guys. I'm kind of fighting the cold here. It's got like a pre-starting inspection and stuff. Hydraulic lift. We don't have a hydraulic lift. This is the uh, uh, non-hydraulic lift. Kind of be nice if I had one, but eh, who needs it? It's okay. Okay, here it is, right here. Adjusting the height of the cut. Oops, sorry. Uh, okay. So we have. Where's my finger? We have, the, there's knots here. I'll actually show you on the tractor itself. Um, you know I'm going to see it, but there's actually a hole right here. You can kind of see it, but there's actually a pin on the second hole. So, on the book, it should say second hole. Where is it? Focusing this for you guys. Three inches. Second hole here from the top is three inches. And that's what I had it set at. It was originally set at two and a half. Um, and I'll set it to three and a half, so you guys can see it. I feel my kicks. I don't want to work like that. I'll see if I can do it one-handed. Now these uh these pins aren't very good. Actually, they're really in, in condition. I can't see if I you guys can see it better. There. Okay. I'm setting it on the mower here. Okay. Um, there's pins back here. These don't want to come out very well, so I usually have like a little hammer where I put it. Um, I have no clue. Crap. <laughs> I have no clue where I actually put it. Um, eh, I'm not too concerned about it right now. It's laying around here somewhere. Um, you know I'm disorganized like that. It never works. Oh well, I guess I can try to get it off by hand. Um, <coughs> oh, not here it is, never mind. Okay. Okay, so, got a nice little hammer here, I don't know if you guys can see it, yeah, nice little hammer. It just helps me get the pin off a little bit, because the pin's real, they're rusted in. Yeah, okay, so, there's your pin, it's on the back here, where is it, right there, it's, it goes in the back, I don't know if you can see it, and then there's actually a, uh, <coughs> excuse me guys, and there's a, that comes out, and then you're able to drop it. Actually, actually, the wheel comes all the way out, I think. 
I haven't actually tried it. No, I'm not gonna break it either. Okay, so, um, I mean that's really how you do it. I wish I could get the wheel all the way out, but you know. All right, let's get the let's get my thing off here, just so I don't break it, because that's not my iPad; it's my school's. And this lower deck's not very well, so. Okay, so I'm not even gonna deal with that, but I'll bring it up so you guys can see it. Hold on. Um. I don't know if you guys can see that. But there's actually holes. There's a hole here. This is your three and a half inch. So the wheel, when you put your deck down, uh, the wheel actually stops it. I mean, so what you do is you take the lever. I mean, and it drops it, but the wheel will stop it at so far of an so far of a distance. So I mean, I cannot move the wheels. They're on the ground, which actually stops it, which is good. Um, I mean, I tested it earlier and it didn't, it was at two and a half and I didn't like it, so I set it up to three. So I'll set it back up here and we'll actually reset it. The other one's at three inches. I can't get back there because it's up against the wall, so. We'll see here. Oh, wait, I guess I have to put my deck back over. <laughs> that would be smart, wouldn't it? Hold on, guys. Wee, roller coaster ride. Oh, I don't want to break that. I'll be mad. Alright, um, let's see here. Make sure I, can you guys see that? Let's see. Um, right there. There you go. Okay. Then you guys can see it. Alright, so I want to do two and a half. Oh, too far. Um, I think that'll fit. Alright, that fit. Now I gotta get the pin in. Um,. I mean, I can actually push this out for you guys to see it. Uh, it doesn't weigh that much. Oh. Come on. Ouch. Okay. So. I'm just actually able to see it. Look right there. Hold on. Let's it for you guys. Right here's your pin. Right here. And then you just pull your pin, slide this out, and then you're able to adjust it on the book. You can go all the way down to one and a half. Oh, sorry. I gotta figure out where my camera's at. You can go all the way down to one and a half inches. I'm at three. I like to keep my yard a little high. Um I mean I gotta get this out. Let me get this out. I'll show you the other side. Bear with me. Yeah, I'll just set it up over here on the car. On my gramps car. It's not my car. <laughs> I wish it was my car. I mean, I guess I gotta go get my keys and do it, but that's too much work for me. So on this side, the previous owner, he put a bigger pin in. It's got two, four, five sections. This is also set at, where is it, where is it? Okay. It's also set at the two and a, no, three inches, my bad. The second hole is the three inch line. Um, I mean, that's pretty much how you change your height on your mower deck. Um, if I could, if I, maybe in a later video, I'll do the uh, height adjustment uh, for the middle blade using that knob over there. Um, I'm not, I don't have any, uh, <coughs> oh, man, excuse me, um, car ramps to get your car up when you're like changing oil and stuff. I don't have that. Um, so, I mean, that's pretty much it for this video. So, uh, Thanks for watching.